My topic is superstition. Superstitions are things people do to prevent bad things from happening or to make sure good things do happen. Superstitions can also be believing something is evil or lucky. Friday the 13th. When you think of superstitions, you probably think of Friday the 13th. A lot of people avoid Friday the 13th or the number 13. For example, airlines and airports don't have a 13th aisle or gate. Most places like hotels and hospitals don't have a 13th floor or room for this reason. Another common superstition is black cats. Crossing a black cat's path is considered unlucky. Black cats are usually with witches or dark magic. This is because witches had domesticated animals like black cats. Pennies on the ground. This is another very common superstition. People think this came from the saying, see a pin, pick it up, and all day you'll have good luck. See a pin, let it lay, and your luck will pass away. Theories. One theory is that sometimes superstitions can have a soothing effect, revealing anxiety about the unknown and giving people a sense of control over their lives. This may also be the reason why superstitions have survived for so long. People have passed them on from generation to generation. Superstitions may objectively improve performance. Stuart Weiss author of Believing in Magic, The Psychology of Superstitions, and former professor of psychology at Connecticut College, explains in an interview for the British Psychological Society, there is evidence that positive luck enchanting superstitions provide a psychological benefit that can improve skilled performance. Their anxiety associated with the kinds of events that bring out superstitions, the absence of control over an important outcome creates anxiety. So even when we know a rational level, there is no magic, superstitions can be maintained by their emotional benefit, says Stuart V. One study explains that superstitions appeal to people because the advantages of carrying around a lucky charm, for example, outweigh the disadvantages of a so-called costly exploration scenario, a situation where a person must explore an uncertain environment. According to the author's superstitions that involve carrying small, lightweight, lucky charms might persist because the same general learning rules for identifying casual relationships in other settings are adventurous while here they do next to no harm. That concludes my presentation. Hope you had fun and remember, be careful around black cats, pick up every penny you find, and don't walk under ladders. Goodbye!